Here's a question on uncertainties that only a quarter of the candidates actually scored correctly. We have a 120 ohm resistor and a 500 ohm resistor, and the percentage of certainty in both of them is plus or minus 10%. What we need to do is to find the uncertainty in the total resistance, assuming that they're in parallel. Please choose an answer now. So first of all, let's just find the total resistance. Our total will be equal to 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2 raised to the power of minus 1, which is going to equal to 1 over 120 plus 1 over 500 raised to the power of minus 1, which is equal to 97 ohms. So we know that the correct answer will be either A or B. Because this is a non-standard formula, we need to use the rule that the uncertainty is equal to half of the range. What is the range of those values? 10% of 120 ohms is just 12 ohms so the minimum value will just be equal to 120 minus 12 which is 108 so we know that the value of this resistor would be somewhere between 108 ohms and 120 plus 10 percent or plus 12 which is 132 ohms so this here is the minimum and this here is the maximum. The real value is somewhere in between. 500 ohms plus or minus 10% will give us minimum value of 450 and then a maximum value of 550 ohms. Now let's calculate the minimum total resistance. So RT minimum is just going to equal 1 over 108 and then plus the minimum here which is 1 over 450 raised to power of negative 1. This is approximately equal to 87 ohms. Now the maximum value is just going to be given by 1 over 132 plus 1 over 150 raised to a negative 1, which is going to give us just 106.45 ohms. Remember, uncertainty is equal to half the range. So the uncertainty is equal to half the range, so it's going to be this value, take away that value. So it's going to be 106.45, take away 87, divided by 2, which is going to give us around 9.7 ohms. Now 9.7 ohms is approximately 10% of our answer, so the correct answer needs to be A. Now uncertainties are very very important in physics. If you've not revised the line of worst fit yet, have a look at this video which is just over here.